Let's hear from Aaron Judge. Aaron, did you think that final uh, at bat, that ball had a chance to get out there? No, off the bat, no. I, I just got underneath a little bit. I knew right when I hit it that it wasn't going to make it, even though I went to the track. I just, just, uh, just underneath it a little bit. He's got a good fastball that really plays up in the zone and just wasn't able to get on top of it and, and uh, score DJ there. Aaron Boone said that Stanton tweaked his hamstring. It's most likely an IL situation. How much of a hit is that just to your lineup, knowing the way that he started the season off? Yeah, that's tough. You know, a guy that's, you know, starting out with MVP numbers, you know, driving the ball, you know, coming up in big situations for us. You know, it's going to be be a tough loss, you know, however long he, he's out. But, you know, our motto, you know, just just like last year was next man up. You know, we had a stacked team. A lot of guys at alternate sides that are, you know, chomping the bit to get the opportunity. So, you know, Stan's going to be missed. But uh, I know there's a lot of guys that are, you know, waiting for the opportunity. What did you see and, and hear transpire in that fifth inning with Vic Carpazzo? Just a, just a lot of yelling. I, I really didn't hear too many specifics. I really didn't know what happened. Also, we got one guy tossed, another guy tossed. And by that time, I'm out on the field, you know, so I, I didn't hear too much. A lot of yelling. I really don't know why somebody got tossed there. So, uh, weird, weird situation. Thanks, Aaron. Take the next one from Brendan Cuddy. Hey, Aaron. Thanks for taking the time. Uh, there was a lot of yelling coming from your guys' dugout seemed like it was directed at the mound um, for the Rays. How did you guys feel about them coming up and in twice to DJ, once to Gio? Yeah, I think it was more just about the history. Um, having somebody throw it, Romine's head uh, a couple of years ago, you know, you don't, you don't usually forget stuff like that, you know, and then for, you know, continue to continue to throw up and in, throw up and in, um, you know, that, that's tough, you know, you know, we got a lot of big hitters up there, and, you know, we know they're going to throw in, but uh, to miss that far up and in, you know, that many times, you know, you're going to get a little barking from the dugout. Does that kind of supersede just this game, though? It seems like this season you guys have seen a lot of up and ins, particularly to Boyd, to you. Yeah, it's, it's just a lineup we have. You know, we got a lot of big power hitters that can drive the baseball, so a lot of teams are really going to try to back us off the plate. You know, it's something that we know that, something that they've done for years now. It's, you know, they want to try to come in and back us off just so they can open up the outer side of the plate. So uh, it's just something we got to deal with, you know, but I know our pitchers are there to protect us. Thank you. Ken David, please unmute. Aaron, when you talk about the history, you're talking uh, about Kit Ridge. I think he was one who, who was with Romine, right? Who he pointed to, so that's, uh, that's what we're talking about. Um. Yeah, 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 he he threw it. Roman said a couple of years ago. You know, anytime someone throws at somebody's head, you usually don't you don't forget that.